Hey guys, I know we haven't done this for a while, but today we're going to be making a video which will be of the top um, city apps of the week. And we have four um, for this video, and starting with Full Drop. What Full Drop does is basically it's a version of Dropbox in which you can um, interact with your file system. So basically, how it works is you can go into iFile or something like that, move any file in from your iPod. It doesn't have to be like a picture where you're restricted to things that Apple allows. You can move any file into your Dropbox and you can also um, download files from your Dropbox onto your system. So this might be nice for maneuvering um, stuff into your phone or taking files that you need to look at out. So that's just a quick overview of that. All the names to search and uh, repos will be in the description. Now the next app we have is YouTube to MP3. Now this is um, a, a really nicely made app. You can see you have a search right here. I'm just going to search iPod Uplink. Generally you'd search like a music video or something, but I do not want to get copyrighted. So um, you can see it has all the videos. All you have to do is, let's say, I want to hear the sound from my jailbreak video. Click that, link copied, go right here, paste it in, and then hit convert. And that takes a while, so I'll just show you one I already have. You can see it plays um, working, and you can hear the intro in that. So um, I'm going to exit out of that. And it's fully functional, and it's a totally great app, so you can get that um, in the description. And another thing I wanted to show you was photos it's called iSocial share and basically what it does is you see a photo it gives you that little button right here and you can send something to Facebook or Twitter just type in your username and it will um, tweet it or Facebook it out and it works in the native photos app um, uh, the last thing I wanted to show you was called per page and some of the awesome extensions I got I'll have both the per page and extensions listed in the description. All you have to do is search this stuff up on Cydia. I believe it's all free. I think social I social share costs one or two dollars. But what you do is you can install these. I think you get the analog clock and the calendar as default and what you do is when you tap on one you can set it to a page on your springboard. I already did that and I'll be showing you Facebook and RSS reader. So if you might have, as you might have noticed, I have this thing that's like a widget on my home screen. It's a lot like Androids, and I really like it. For some reason, it shows I think only fan pages, or at least that's what happen, happening for me. It takes a little. It's sort of hard to set up, but I think it's pretty cool. And you see, you can have the Facebook app right there. Um, none of it is clickable on the home screen, but it does update in intervals that you can set. And you can see also my RSS reader right here. It says title here. That That's not working perfectly. I have my RSS. You can see it goes over a little bit there. Other than that, um, per page is a pretty cool tweak because it's a lot harder setting it up. You can take it off and put it on pages. Um, it works um, okay. And I just like the idea of having widgets. And I hope it gets expanded into something better. That's pretty much all I have for this video. Um, if you liked it, subscribe. We'll have more in the future. Check out our jailbreak videos. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.